From News 5, here's your Power of 5 weather in today's top stories, sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital. It is going to be a warm, wet, and windy end to 2018, that is for sure. We are under a wind advisory from 7 p.m. tonight until 7 a.m. tomorrow as wind gusts could get close to 60 miles per hour. And guess what? Temperatures could get close to 60 degrees. Very warm out there today. Temperatures will continue to rise all throughout the afternoon. Heavy rain as well. Some places expected to see close to half an inch, maybe even more than that, close to three quarters of an inch of rain by the time this giant system continues to push across the area. This is the same system that's making its way towards the east coast and will bring lots of rain for New York City for that ball drop. So we'll get out. It'll get out of here before midnight. This is at 11 o'clock, so maybe a few straggling showers, but overall we will be mainly dry come midnight. After that, we do dry out and we do uh, see those temperatures drop down in a big way. We'll only see an afternoon high of 38 degrees on Tuesday, and then we'll dry out for Wednesday, 36 degrees and 37 degrees on Thursday. All right, thank you, Cameron. I'm Mona Kosarabdi with your top stories. Right now, authorities are searching for a man who may be connected to an Akron shooting involving an eight-year-old boy. They say Randy Fitzgerald is considered armed and dangerous. Back in May, a nine-year-old shot his eight-year-old cousin after finding a gun while left in, alone in the home. Investigators say they believe the gun belonged to Fitzgerald. If you see him, do not approach him. Just simply call 911. If you're planning on drinking this New Year's Eve, make sure that you have a safe ride home. Cleveland Police Foundation is partnering with Lyft, donating up to $10,000 in free ride credits. Partygoers in downtown Cleveland will see police officers handing out Lyft promo cards for $10 off rides. And the annual walleye drop is happening tonight in Port Clinton. Instead of a sparkly ball, a huge 600-pound light-up fish will help ring in the new year. Thousands are expected to attend the event. Organizers say it's a way to bring attention to the tourist town in the winter. Well, that's it for now. For the latest news and weather, you can go to News5Cleveland.com or open the News5 app. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital.